Saturday will mark one year since the streetcar started running in downtown Kansas City. And while some businesses reported issues in the weeks leading up to the launch, the ones we spoke with today are happy about what the streetcar has done for them. The Now's Ray Daniel explains. In just a few days, the KC streetcar will be a year old. It's easy to go around. It's fun to do stuff. We always do play dates on there. While Cindy Diner did have some issues when construction began on the streetcar, employee Jessica Lopez says she has noticed a difference. It's everything's pretty smooth right now. We're kind of working together. I think for the community, it's just really better the community. It's given people access to, you know, get from one place to another without having to deal with traffic during the weekends and so it's nice. And right around the corner, Roots and Branches, a hair salon in River Market, state while business has been the same, they have seen change. So definitely when we see the streetcar go by several times a day, it's usually at full capacity and we really love seeing people utilize it. And since the streetcar has made its way to the area, both businesses say the biggest challenge right now is parking. Parking has been a little crazy because everyone wants to get you know, jump on the first stop. I think the River Market's probably one of the only large capacity of free parking available for people to hop onto the streetcar. So some of our clients and um, people that work here have had a problem parking during the day. So I'd like to see more available parking for all of us. While they hope more parking becomes available, they're also excited about the possibility of expansion. Really eager and hopeful that it continues and moves to the plaza or UMKC and really actually transitions the whole downtown area. For the now KC, I'm Ray Daniel. And we spoke with KC streetcar leaders and they said they're at the very beginning of stages of looking at operational costs and what it would take to expand to UMKC. There's been a lot of talk about that. They're also throwing a birthday celebration for the streetcar. It's this Saturday.